So we have the instructions out. There's just pictures I'm looking at. So what are we doing today? Well, we're trying to get the uh, doors on, the end panels on, and get it ready for the cover to go on. And then the roll-up sides. It's supposed to get cold again. A couple days of warm weather. Half the parts aren't labeled, so we're going to sort that out. The instructions are terrible. These tech screws, they give you about 30% are garbage. So, there's a lot of sorting and looking and a trying few, to figure it out. A few setbacks to deal with. Yeah. But I think it'll be nice when I get some things fixed. So, one of the things on the end panels, they don't have anything on the bottom, right? So, your panel, your cover would just not be secured on the bottom so i'm gonna put some two by sixes across there some treated boards so i have something to anchor to the doors just screw on on the outside which is kind of hokey so i may end up putting a treated two by four to just kind of sandwich it to hold it but that'll work for now these pipes are what the roll-up doors will go between so you just suspend these up in the air and then use our wonderful tech screws and screw that to it so that's kind of a hillbilly rig i think um hey it's fun it'll be good thankful for the tractor the good weather a marginal help The clamps are handy, so if you ever go to put plastic on, get you some of those wood clamps. They can help hold the stuff while you get it screwed on. It's good times. Need about 10 people. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. So why are you drilling all these holes? Uh, let me tell you, in today's world of manufacturing, it's all about cutting costs and doing things cheaper. So when you have an opportunity to pass on the labor and the, the cost to the consumer, it seems that's what you do. So we've had to drill about 8,000 holes, put in 12 million tech screws, and uh, it's fun. It would have been a lot easier if they just would have punched the holes in where they needed to be. But it's okay. That's how it goes. So goes. So goes. But what these holes are for, these are for J bolts that go through. So you zigzag some string through these grommets. And uh, then. When you got it closed up or when it's windy, I guess you just hook it around the, the J bolt. So it doesn't do that. So it doesn't do that.
Are you giving up on the drilling and just using duct tape to keep it together? You can duct tape anything together. This isn't just any regular duct tape. This is 3M extra strength waterproof gray duct tape by the roll. No, you tape it so the sharp edges of the metal don't cut your plastic or your material. I think we removed all the sharp edges, but I can always cut the tape off when we're done if I want. <laughs> 